live. All right, and we're live at Expert 35 today with Christian Acosta, valedictorian, and one of our rock stars that made this all happen. Uh, today he's getting celebrated by his school. Uh, but before they swing by, let's go ahead and introduce Chris. Chris, I mean, <laughs> Christian, what's going on, man? Hey, what's up? Glad to, glad to be back. Glad to be back. You want to introduce us to your family and show us who's sitting, sitting out at the doorsteps? Yes, let's go ahead and walk through. Um, right there on the stairs, I have my Aunt Melinda. Hold up, let's go ahead and scoot closer. I have my Aunt Melinda there on the stairs. I don't know if you can see her. Hold up, I'm angling the camera. There she is. There we right go. there behind me. Right here with me, I have my brother Marcus. Say hello. Say hi to the camera. Yeah. Oh, I have my live. sister Emilia. What's up, Emilia? Say hi. I hope mommy's watching at work. And I have my dad. I'm glad for him to be here. Say hi. Hello. Hi. And then over there on the outside, I have our dean of instruction, Dr. Chang, and my friend Jonathan. Very cool. And he's one of the deans of the school? Yes, he is. Yes, he is. We're live on Expert 35. That's right. Yes. So tell us a little bit That's about right. how, and tell us a little bit about your high school and how it's how it's organized. Well, um, I go to the Houston Academy for International Studies. It's an early college high school and it's a international study school. Uh, it's designated by the Asia Society. Um, they allow us to complete an associate's degree, and they give us numerous opportunities to study abroad. That's right. And you went abroad, right? Where did you go? You went to Beijing? No. Yes, I went to Shanghai, China for six weeks in 2018. And what languages do you speak now? Now, uh, I can speak English, of course. Well, so do one. And un poquito de español. <laughs> and he's going to be a rice owl. He already is a rice owl. He's going to Rice University next year. Yes, I'm very excited to go to Rice. First generation, right, going to college. How did that all happen? Like, how did you, you know get into the path of like, hey, I want to go to college and I want to do all this. Tell us a little bit about that side of the story. Well, in terms of going to college, I have my Aunt Teresa Mendoza to thank for that. She pushed, and my Uncle Louis Mendoza, they both pushed me very hard to get me to college and they never stopped. And I always had the passion to go to college and see something great happen. Nice. And, um, so, sorry, just arriving is Mr. Smith. He's our internship coordinator. Um, oh, wait, so he's the guy I should be talking to. He's the one that got us hooked up. <laughs> yes, he's the one that got us hooked up. I don't know if you can see him on your camera. I yes. can, I can see him. Um, he, he's in his truck. He's in the uh, Black GMC, for those of you who are viewing at home. Um, but continuing on, the reason I chose Rice is because originally I was going to go on a fly into Swarthmore College in Philadelphia. Then I got trapped in by Hurricane, I mean, by Tropical Storm Imelda. And I was stuck at the airport from 4 a.m. to 6 o'clock at night. I didn't get home till 9 o'clock after traveling through the flooded freeways. The next day, I had the fly-in at Rice University. And from there, I never looked back. Nice. That's right, because all your schedules got changed, right? Now, now with COVID, it's even crazier because you can't go anywhere. You couldn't visit any schools. <laughs> that, that's correct. I should be at school today, but here I am. That's awesome. We just got Jennifer throwing in a congratulations. Well, thank you. Uh, Jennifer thank Johnson's you. been one of our experts on the show, and I think I got the – is he pulling up behind me? Am I in the front of the road? Yeah, he's right behind you. <laughs> right behind you. I might have to put my – I might have to put my mask on if we're going we're gonna to jump out of the car. Wait, hold on. I couldn't hear that. Sorry. Cut out a little. Uh, I think that one of your – the internship coordinator just jumped in behind me. So he's in, he's in the car behind me. Yes, that's correct. He just pulled up behind. Well, how big how big is your yeah, school right now? How many seniors? Um, our school is 100 seniors, and overall size is just a little bit under 500. And you, you went there from freshman year through through high school. Did you transfer in? I went through the the full four years. I came from Lanier Middle School to uh, the Houston Academy for International Study. Well, that's amazing. I mean, just first generation going to college. Earlier today on Expert 35, we had Judy talking about the process of going in there and moving forward. And uh, and now we've got a, a, good, a great question from Jennifer. Is like, what advice do you have for other high school students 
right now? Oh, uh, that's a that's a great question. Great question. I love it. Um, I would say my best advice for high school students right now is the my aunt used to always tell me this: the competition starts as soon as you step foot on the campus. Everything counts, and I feel like a lot of people don't realize it. I would talk to a lot of my fellow classmates, and they said that their freshman year was the one that they regretted the most. So definitely take it seriously as you're starting out. If you're further in, just enjoy your time. Because as you can see, time will take away from you anytime. Right, right. Well, here, should put, put your internship guy on the, on, the, on the screen. I know you got to turn your phone kind of funky. But maybe yeah, let me turn it on. Say hi thing. real quick. See behind you, there he is. Do you want to come? <laughs> Welcome to Expert 35. Hey, how's it going? Hey, thank you so much for letting us have Christian for so long. He's helped us launch Expert 35, Hop to See, Techify. Just an incredible, incredible asset. And uh, super excited he's staying in Houston and going to University. Not sure what he's saying. Wait, you have to repeat that because it's cutting out. Hold up. Let me, let's step a little bit further so that way we can get some Wi Fi. Just a little laggy. But basically, what he was saying was that uh, he introduced you to the internship coordinator. You said the two reasons that we got uh, connected. Oh, ah, okay, okay. Yes. So I just want a little advice on uh, how to get those. Yeah, no, Christian has been super solid. I've been with the highs before, I guess. Elizabeth helped us uh, two years ago. And uh, and that's how you and uh, she knew Christian. And, man, just we'd love to be involved more. The the students that you guys bring, the, the level of communication, their maturity is just outstanding. Well, we try and make sure that all of our uh, high students, they display the level of academic success and uh, maturity in their internship oh, watch up that we uh, expect. What's up behind us? Oh, it's all live. It's on. It's on. Good to see you. Good to see you. Good to see you. Get to see her, get to see her. And just arriving, the people from my school, all my teachers, my principal, my other dean, they all just arrived. I'm trying to show it on my camera. I don't know how well I'm showing it. <laughs> Everybody's coming out now. Yeah, I'm going to jump back. Hello. <laughs> Woo! Oh, you got another shot coming through. Mr. Polly, he's a former math teacher of mine. Yes. Yeah. Wow, that's fantastic. Welcome, welcome. I'm so glad to see you. Hi. Oh, <laughs> uh, yes. Be careful. If you want, come on the sidewalk. Come on the sidewalk. It'd be better. So, yeah, you safer. Yes. Wait, you have an AP exam to get to. <laughs> I can't tell you how happy I am to see my Gabe, can you turn your uh, turn your camera for me? Can you see us because this is the crew coming out? Can you turn the camera? Hey. Still. Gabriel, could you turn your camera? This year, so this is amazing for a uh, class of 2020 surviving the COVID apocalypse. Hey. 
Hey, Gabriel, can you turn your camera sideways? I think you hanged it off the phone off. Got to get that there. Oh, I got myself a yesterday. Gabriel, could you turn your phone sideways? Gabriel, could you turn your phone the other way? Can you hear me? Christian, does he want you to turn your phone? <laughs> Hey, Gabe, can you hear me? <laughs> Greg, can you still hear us? I can hear you now. Gabe, can you can you hear me? Can you hear me, Gabe? You turn your phone sideways. Thank you. 
Thank you. Thank everybody for watching the podcast too. Yes. I'm so high to proud. Yes. Yes. I'm sure when everything blows over, we'll have our own proper celebration. Yes. Maybe late, but late is better than never. Yes. Yes. Yeah, don't worry, it'll be okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yes, I'm trying to. That's the best way to And then you can have your own. Thank you. Oh, I miss you. Oh, yeah, you love it. Yes, please, please. Dad. Oh, I was like, do you need us from behind this? Can you hear me? Okay, Gabriel, can you hear me? You're on you're on the you're live. All together. Can't hear you, Gabriel. Yes, let's do it. I miss y'all too. Gabriel, can you hear me? Thank you. Come on, at least my siblings. Come on, y'all. Come on, Lucas. Can you hear me, Gabriel? Gabriel, can you hear me? I don't know that you can. Hey, Christian, it's Gray. Can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you. Yeah, I've, I've got Gabe on on the. He's live, but uh, we can't we can't quite hear him. Did you want me to talk for you? Look, this one, video. Yeah. So. Uh, uh, Christian, tell, tell, tell us how you feel. Well, uh, oh my god, I couldn't be proud of it. Uh, it's nice to have a nice time to be It's been a long time. It's been a long time. It's been a long time. I went to China. I was in my heart. But I think now we made it all worth it in the end. And yeah. I know she's watching from heaven. She's going to be very proud. Oh, that's just fantastic. Um, just can't it's just amazing to see just the outpouring of support and um uh just lots of people uh with questions um people watching getting their shout outs um it's just uh fantastic to uh fantastic to see well, yes i'm appreciative of everybody who's on if you're watching thank you i rallied as many people as i could bringing in the expert 35. <laughs> yeah. Well, uh, Christian, uh, a question that we have is that the people wants to know, wants to know like uh, who inspires you. There's a excuse me. There's a lot of people who inspire me. Um, let's see if I could choose. Well, that it would depend. My aunt has inspired me a lot because she inspired me to continue through with my education, and she made sure that that was the basis of everything. But also, the people here have inspired me as. As well, they kept me going. They would keep my intellectual abilities up. They would make sure that I got stronger and that I was rice ready. And also, my mentor, Gabriel, he's done an amazing job with me, and I'm really appreciative that I got to run into him at Barnaby's at one day. It was just like a stroke of luck that I ran into him. 
We didn't even know. I'm he emailed me and I just showed up and I was like, okay, I didn't even remember calling him, but he I did and I got the job at Tech Studios and I never looked back. Well, yes. that's that's just fantastic. Well, is there anybody else that you uh, that you want to introduce? Or um, I can't I can't get Gabe on the um, on the show. Yeah, he's uh, right here. Um, he okay. kind of went off. He's right is here. It, yeah, his um, audio working. Anybody want to come? Anybody? Anybody? Uh, well, I see. Uh, I see. Uh, you better do your exam. <laughs> this is uh, Miss Bubba. She was my chemistry teacher, but now she's the biology teacher. Mm -hmm. Um. Yes, please. Did you? Is there anything you'd like to say? Oh, um, he is the only kid so far in the past four years at high who always came to my class looking to learn something every single day. Yeah. Did you want to join? Come on in. Who is this? This is Expert Thirty Five. We're live on Facebook. Oh yeah. I'm his Chinese teacher, and it's one of the greatest honor to teach him. Anybody else? Anybody? You come on. This is my principal. Oh, here we go. I taught Christian in seventh grade, and all I have to say about him is heart and perseverance all the way, and I know he's going to keep it up. Yes, she was my Texas history teacher in seventh grade, and now she followed, followed me to Heist as the magnet coordinator. And Rice, too. She's working over the summer in the, in the library. Yes. Anybody else? Come on. Our, our college access coordinator, Ms. Corbett Williams. Hi, Christian, Christian. Um, Rice University, get ready. He is going to take over that university. Love you, love you, love you. Look for great things for this kid. He is amazing. Good Thank job. you. <laughs> yes, this is a few of my teachers. I don't know if anybody else is coming right now. Oh, yeah, Ms. Jacobs coming. Here we go. Ms. Jacobs already, is our principal. I already said my speech, but I am so glad you're going to be close by. And I hope you just um, reach back and pull up, right? So all of the other high students who um, aspire to be like you, thank you for being their inspiration. Thank you for being, um, like I said, helping us run the school for the last four years. But please continue as you move forward remember those behind you that they're looking to you for inspiration they're looking to you as a mentor just as your mentor has influenced you it's going to be your turn soon to influence others so we're excited you're staying in houston we're excited you're at rice and we're excited you're right down the street so this is no means goodbye this is we can't wait to see the next amazing things you will do love you christian thank you i promise i'm gonna stay with my high school they, they've done a lot for me and i gotta give give back indeed yes well, that's fantastic. that's fantastic, Christian. Um, if uh, can you get Gabe? Can you walk over where Gabe is? Yes, I can. And get him. Yeah, you're gonna have to do like a, a selfie version. Oh, you're on. You're on. Okay, cool. Is he on? Oh, is he on? Okay, hang on. Let me try. Okay, Gabe, you're on air. Can we hear you? Wait, are you on air? Christian, I can't hear his. It's his audio. I just bring it. I just bring him to bring, bring yeah. him over. Come on in. Christian's been amazing. Thank you so much for joining us on Expert Thirty Five Live. We couldn't have done it without Christian. Christian started this, helped us really build it up. We couldn't be prouder of him going to race. I'm glad he's staying close to, to Houston because then he can keep staying involved and keep helping this community. He's been such a big part of. So, couldn't be proud of you, man. Congratulations. Thank you. He helped me get in. So, yes, he helped me make that decision. All right. Well, fan fantastic. Well, Christian, thanks so much for uh, sharing this with us. And uh, I know everybody just uh, really, really loved to see it. And it was great meeting everybody. So uh, any any final words before we uh, before we sign off? Well, yes, for sure. Make sure that you tune in to Expert 35 for what we got for the rest of the week. I know we got um, we got Jennifer Johnson working with networking and then we got a cool thing on Friday. Don't miss it. Je Jenna's coming in. So make sure to watch. And then we got Dr. Malik coming in tomorrow, so make sure to tune in. Expert 35, 9.35 a.m. Couldn't have done it any better myself. We'll see you later. Have a good one. All righty. Bye-bye.